You're so calm right now, Sarah. Good morning. Morning. Say good morning, Sarah. Oh, we heard from the renters. They're not gonna wait till Thursday morning. Well, Thursday. Good. Oh well. So I don't know what we're gonna do if we're gonna either stay in a hotel or ask our managers if we can stay one extra night. I don't know, but we'll figure it out. It'll be okay. Something exciting happened last night. We put her in her bassinet and she was fussy, but she ended up putting herself to sleep. She didn't sleep through the whole night. She only slept for like 20 to 30 minutes, but that was really good and really exciting for me because she usually just starts crying and fussing and never calms down. So I'm hoping that this will continue and that eventually she'll be able to put herself to sleep in her bassinet and won't need to be in her bed as much. That's progress and that makes me happy. Winston, come here. Come here. Come here. Come up. I really don't want that toy, Winston. Arthur, like I noticed they did something. When I put the pants on, I'm like, man, they're not fitting the way they used to. These are my old maternity pants. It's like, how, do I, you, how do you put them on backwards? Them, like, that's the butt. I put them on backwards. I wasn't looking, I just grabbed them and It was stepped dark and I them. couldn't see. So that's oh. what happened. I just staring at the So, wait, are those the butt pockets then? Yep. And you didn't realize it at that time? No, because I was, I was pulling from here and I'm like, man, it's not going over my butt. What's wrong? <laughs> and then when I pulled this up, I'm like, oh, it's going up really high. And I looked down and I was like, oh, oh that's why. She put herself to sleep. She was a little tired and I put her in and she went to sleep. And daddy's asleep too. And Winston was asleep, but I woke him up. So I've got more stuff to pack in the kitchen. We have one box left. We're gonna have to go get some boxes tonight. Oh, and also, you have no idea when we're actually gonna be moving. We're supposed to be out of here tomorrow, but I don't know if that's actually gonna happen just because the people that are in our house right now, I'm not sure if they're, if they realize that they're supposed to be out by the 31st, but they're saying something like they might be there till Thursday, maybe. Friday. I hope not because I need to get a hotel two nights in a row. Unless we're able to talk to our apartment managers and see if they'll let us stay here two more nights. Maybe. But I'd rather just be in our house. I'm so excited to have a house. Um, anyway, so I'm going to pack up uh, some of the things. So my little helper woke up and she's going to be, are you going to help me pack everything up, Sarah? Yeah, so we're still packing. I had Arthur go ahead and take a nap because we're gonna be up really late. And I've already had a few naps today with her. So just having him go ahead and get some sleep. My return with honor, it says, I love you, have fun, be safe, don't die. Which that's pretty much what I tell Arthur every time he leaves and I stay home or if he drops me off at school. Anytime we have to be apart from each other, I always tell them that. So this is like just a big giant sticker that you can write a dry erase sticker. Kind of left a ring, but that's all right. Arthur uploaded our video uh, for today, which is yesterday. So two days ago, stay. Anyway. When we uploaded it, we had um, someone commented as well, and Arthur accidentally deleted it. So that was sad. So I re-uploaded it, but that's okay. It happens. It's just funny, because Arthur was in bed, like, looking at his phone. And I just hear this, No! I deleted it! So we need more boxes. Um, I'm making a list of things that we need. Like the stove cleaner, like inside that foam that you spray inside the stove. Uh, boxes, obviously. Uh, 
Big carpet cleaner. We don't have a mop. I just realized we do not own a mop. So maybe we'll have to buy one or borrow one from Cheryl. Spot, they're sleeping in Sarah's boppy. That's for Sarah, not for Spot. The Spot is gross. Spot. And Spot pees on things. Or he throws up on them. And I'd rather you not throw up on that. But you look so stinking cute. I have actually had Spot since I was a girl. Oh, I don't even remember when we got him. At least since 2003 and he was fully grown then. Because he was actually a stray. He uh, just walked into my sister's apartment in Houston. She couldn't keep him so she just brought him over to my parents' house. And my mom loved him. So we kept him basically after I got married, like a year or so after that, we were able to bring him home. And so he's been with Arthur and I since then. Is it raining outside? Are you scared? Is it raining? What's wrong? Are you scared? Are you scared? Are you scared? <coughs> yeah. You're very scared, aren't you? Mm hmm. <coughs> I think he can hear a lot of noise, which is probably why he's freaking. All the thunder. And Look. being outside when it thundered didn't help. He's looking how he hears her. Come here. Come here, Spot. Say bye. 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 <coughs> Goodbye. <coughs> Goodbye, Spot. <coughs> Goodbye. <coughs> Thanks for watching. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.